Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to more Overgrowth. Today we're playing Alpha 203, and with it comes quite a few changes. Number one, we can increase the uh, stature of our character, so we can uh, scale him up to uh, sort of a reasonable size within, uh, I guess... Uh, you know, in in the anthropomorphic world, uh, it kind of makes sense. Uh, you can sort of have a four to five foot height differential between you and uh, and other uh, characters, and I think that makes sense. Maybe in the future we'll be able to scale it as much as we want. But for now, you can do uh, some moderate scaling, and then you could also increase the uh, amount of fat and uh, the amount of muscle that a character has. Uh, you can see that I have very much increased the uh, amount of fat that this character has, but I've also uh, given him some muscle, but sort of uh, when you when you do them both together, they kind of uh, counteract each other a little bit. So he's sort of, uh, you know, he's, he's a fat, muscly guy, and uh, he's quite a bit taller than uh, all the enemies here. So, uh, yeah, today we're going to be messing around a lot with the, uh, with the customization options. I didn't, uh, I didn't change any of the enemies, uh, you know, that's, I can probably do that in this video, but, you know, I, it, it all has to do with, uh, pressing escape and, uh, actually fucking with the parameters. So that's what I'll do right now. I'm gonna actually reset everyone into their, uh, positions, and, uh, we're going to change this guy's... Uh, size and everything so I'm gonna move that out of the way and we're going to uh, sort of do a side-by-side -side here and show you what you can do so I'm gonna make this guy smaller than he would normally be so I think uh, we're scale character scale so we can make him quite a bit smaller he's a tiny tiny fucking rabbit tiny <laughs> this is gonna be very interesting you can increase or decrease their ear size um, this guy's ear size I can make really small so you know they just look like sticks I can make him really fat. Uh, he almost looks like one of those uh, little fox type things with the fat ass ears. Uh, and, you know, during a National Geographic uh, special or something. You've seen those before. I don't know what they're called. Uh, I can make him a fat small rabbit. But I think I'm going to keep him sort of skinny, sort of on the thin side. If you do it, you know, very either really small or really fat, you can sort of start to see, like, it not looking so good. So you just kind of want to do it within reason. Any, any skinnier than this, like, right there, and it starts to look kind of weird. Because uh, he just did it based on, like, their bone skeleton or whatever. Bone skeleton? What am I saying? <laughs> um, but he, he ba did it based off their skeleton, so it'll it'll shrink around, I guess, where the, where the uh, you know, the joints and the bones are. Uh, so that could, I guess that could lend to some weird, uh, some weird shrinkage or growage. And, uh, what else can we do? We can make, we can make him muscly. We can make him really muscly. So, uh, there's some muscle on him. And, uh, I think that looks pretty good. I think that looks pretty damn good. <laughs> He's very small. It's gonna be hard to see him. And then, uh, let's do it with the dog, and then I'll switch back to my character. Alright, so here's the dog, and, uh... He also added some some uh, increased tail physics. There were tail physics before, but I, I think he made them better somehow. I'm not exactly sure how. Uh, anyway, let's uh, let's make him slightly bigger. I want to fight. I want to fight a uh, a fellow big guy. So we are going to increase his scale to maximum. So he's gonna be very tall. Uh, I'm not gonna make him fat. I'm not gonna make him too fat, at least. You know what? I'm just gonna increase his muscle. He needs to look pretty, pretty heavy. <laughs> look at that. Pretty fucking heavy duty, and uh, we're going to uh, mess around with his ears. You can also shrink the ears. I think the smaller ears look better. Uh, the the dog ears kind of fan out when you increase them uh, on the ear size parameter, so I'm going to keep them kind of small, and uh, I think that looks good for now. All right, let's go up to our character, and, and uh, let's go kick some ass. I'm going to use this uh, big-ass blade. And uh, we're going to go Assassin's Creed on their asses. <laughs> Alright, pretty good. Oh, shit. He is fucking intimidating as hell. His head is tiny, <laughs> but his body is huge. Die! <laughs> I know, we should have a proper sword fight. I'll, I'll, I'll have a proper sword fight with him. But I want to kill this one first so that we can have a proper sword fight. Alright, that didn't look right because of the scaling and everything. But, uh... Oh, will he be able to pick that up? Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. <laughs> Alright, this is a little bit of a bug. This. Oh, shit. He picked it up. Alright. 
Oh, yeah. Vulnerable as shit. All right, there we go, guys. Uh, he's down. Uh, and then we're going to fight the small one here in a minute. All right, he's... Oh, no, no. Don't... You little bugger. Bugger off, little bugger. All right. I don't know... I don't know if they're... Uh, I don't know. Let me, let me fight him. I don't know if I'm at some sort of advantage by being bigger. I'd imagine I would be slightly, but I don't... I honestly don't know how. He's already running away, though. I'm a little bit puzzled by that. What are you two doing? No! <laughs> I still get my ass kicked as a, as a fat guy. Well, it makes sense, right? I don't know. This guy's got a lower center of gravity. <laughs> I'm kind of cutting right over his head, but it looks like uh, that was enough. Ooh, kick to the face. Make you a disgrace to the rabbit race. All right, there you go. He's done, and uh, I guess we're going to clean house here if I can. Uh, do I I'm not going to give him this knife, but I'm going to try to keep it slightly even. Oh, shit. Okay, that's what countering looks like. Come on, fight me. I want to get more counters off. All right, that actually looks pretty good. I thought you know, things would clash when you tried to uh, do some special moves, but it looks like it's, it's working out just fine. It's actually going to be really interesting to see how it affects certain aspects of gameplay, because I know there are a lot of... Uh, sort of neat procedural animations that uh, that we've encountered and it's going to it's going to be kind of nice to see how uh, to see how it looks I suppose with you know what let's try that right now cuz I think I can do that uh, I didn't uh, I didn't calculate nav mesh so I don't think they'll be able to get up here uh, I I didn't want to do that god damn it <laughs> let's get his attention really quick I don't want to get everyone's attention just his maybe the other one Oh, that didn't... It almost worked. It almost worked. Yeah. <laughs> I'm too fat. I'm way too fat and clumsy to pull this shit off. Yeah, yeah. It's 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 kind of working. As I'm falling off the ledge, I'm doing my... Yeah, my spiral kick. <laughs> All right. That's pretty dope. Um, I'm playing with the mouse and keyboard right now, so I'd, I'm probably not going to be able to uh, pull off the Capoeira kick. Uh, anyway, uh, that's pretty much the extent of it. He, uh, he made it so that you can, uh, quickly switch to the, uh, dog character. So, uh, I could play as a fat-ass dog for now. And, uh, I could also switch it until I like the, uh, flavor of dog. Which flavor of dog do I like? I don't know, they're all so good. <laughs> uh, you can also change to the cat, which is, uh, currently kind of fucked up, but, you know, that'll change in the future. Uh, the cat, the rabot... Uh, which doesn't make much sense, you know, being that fat of a rabbit. I mean, rabot. And then the wolf is also kind of jacked up right now. I would I would say that the rabbit models look the best so far, especially the civilian. I think the civilian rabbit, I think his, his shirt sort of uh, scales nicely. It's sort of, it's, it's kind of like the uh, the fat guy Hawaiian shirts. You know, it kind of looks like that a little bit. It's I think it scales quite nicely. It kind of hangs over and everything. Uh, so that's cool. Uh, let me kick his ass if I can. I don't know if I'll be able to. Oh, look at that shit. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Punch him. Punch him. Punch him in the noggin. In the noggin. Can I really take on two guys at the same time? Well, one of them's small. I really have the advantage here. No, he's going to kick me. Maybe I can leg cannon. I need to take one out before I can take out the other. <laughs> There you go. All right, let's uh, switch characters. All right, so this is the uh, the other model that uh, Aubrey made uh, a couple patches ago. I think it was patch 200, something like that. Um, and then, of course, Assassin's Creed. Wait, where is he? There he is. Uh, there's The female is looking really bad. <laughs> mainly mainly in the chest department there. It's not... Yeah, that didn't that didn't scale well at all. It's, it's sort of like a weird freaking protrusion doesn't make much sense anyway uh all of this i imagine will get uh, refined in the future you know the wolf isn't looking uh, all that good right now but uh the rest of them you know they're looking they're looking pretty nice looking pretty nice uh, turner's looking okay uh his ropes scale up pretty well um the, the maybe the uh the walking animations might have to change as they're scaled up and I can't imagine how difficult that's going to be uh, for David to do. That's kind of that's kind of a weird thing. But, uh, you know, I feel like he's just making more work for himself. <laughs> I really do. I, I don't think he ever... 
he ever wants to fucking finish this game. <laughs> but you know what? I'm enjoying every minute of it. These updates are fantastic. Alright, guys. Um, I guess I'll just fuck around for a little while longer. Because I'm really enjoying... I just enjoy looking at them. Quite honestly. So, uh, let's do some, uh, let's do some slow-mo combat when it makes sense, like right now. Uh, he's dead. You can't block that. No way you're gonna block that. No way you're gonna block that. Oh, this guy. This guy's got a fervor. You think you can handle me, boy? No, you can't! Oh, shit, he caught it. No, 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 please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. He's gonna hurt me. Oh, no. Oh, that's 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 a little too big for you, Sonny. That's a little too big for you. Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that. Is he dead? He's dead. What the hell, man? I was really expecting him to uh, eat my lunch, but he didn't. All right, I want I want him to catch it again. No, he didn't catch it that time. That's quite unfortunate. He caught it though. All right, let's see if we can defeat him. Ooh, punch. Wow, I'm I'm kicking ass as the fat civilian. I'm kicking a lot of ass. Alright, let's let's fight someone more my size. Uh, should I throw it? Okay, he got it. Alright. Now this will be slightly fairer, I think. I'm trying to slow it down to make it look cooler. I don't know if it's working. No, you bastard! No oh crap! <laughs> I need to be able to leg cannon someone. Let's uh, let's try that. Oh, how am I gonna do that? I kind of want to sneak up on them a little bit. Here we go. <gasps> Boo! Oh damn it! <laughs> I don't know. I, oh, you know what? That's. I wonder if uh, their uh, their increased stature or decreased stature is gonna affect how. How easy it is to uh, to pull off the leg cannon. That's going to be interesting to uh, find out. Come on. Come on. No. Did that hit him? I don't know if it did. You butthole. You stay right there, butthole. No. Yes. Leg cannon. Oh, he kicked me into the air. Don't juggle me. Oh, I just broke. Ah, oh, man. I would have been fine if I had done it slightly sooner but I was too late on my recovery roll alright guys that's gonna do it for me we have a lot of cool uh, fucking overgrowth videos planned for the future uh, this update was awesome and uh, David came out with it relatively quick I think it was uh, a couple weeks maybe two weeks or so I don't know I'm, I haven't been keeping great track of it but it was fairly fucking quick and I want it to keep coming bust your hump Bust your hump, David. Bust your hump, Aubrey. We want to see more, more overgrowth, because this is this is an awesome update, and uh, you know, the people love it. The people love overgrowth. The people fucking love overgrowth. You know what? Let's let's end things on a wait, wait. Oh, that I don't know if that looks good. Ah, another thing that we'll have to consider. Gosh, he's definitely made more work for himself. Cause look at this. Uh, let's ragdoll everyone really quick. Let's 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 all get up, and then let's slit my throat. Uh, I guess that looks just as good. I was thinking it would come uh, from deeper inside of his uh, his fat body, but it, do it doesn't look like it did. Looks like uh, that's working out pretty damn well. <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and remember to tune in next time when I butcher a Brahmin. What's a Brahmin? Oh, that's from Fallout. A Brahmin is from Fallout. All right, that's cool. But it is super difficult. Uh, I explained it before in a uh, video about procedural generation in Overgrowth, uh, and that's to do that cool-ass fucking kick. You know, I don't know how intended it is, 